his final checks. Just about ready to go. Two of the top four teams in the Eastern Conference. Light the lamp on a Wednesday evening here in Louisville. Loose. Pressure very high up the field here from Louisville. Charleston can't get it out of their own half of the field. Winder. That was long distance and slices wide. In the Charleston battery, you need to get going on the front line. Mechanic, Avila, Reedy, Williams, they need to come alive to play off between the lines. That was your watch out. Lancaster, Cameron Lancaster, just wide. Side, Kyle Adams just picks up his head and says there's real estate in behind. Leland Archer just misreads the flight of the ball. Cameron Lancaster does everything right. Opens up his hips, Trey Muse is out of position. Two yards into the, inter into the interior, it's 1-0 Lou City. You see the frustration. And the first half whistle blows as well from Brandon Stevis. That was our best chance of the half from either side in a shot where you normally expect Lancaster, third all-time in USL championship history, to bag one. What an impact Olawashai has made for San Antonio. He had that breakout match against Charleston back on May 13th with a hat trick, and he continues to pile up. Elite goal scoring numbers. There's some space for Winder. Winder winds up, and this is wide. He's had a couple opportunities in this game, hasn't hit the frame. Blue City is a more potent side. They're the team that seemingly is in more control. They've really not conceded any kind of knee knocking moments to Charleston. Lock comes out. He has been asked to do very little this evening. But I do think the longer that this stays nil-nil, it gives more hope to the batter the, to the battery to steal one here. Here's Avila. Avila winds up. Semla saves it and can't keep it in play. It goes out for a corner. Most in the USL championship. They've given up the fourth fewest goals overall this season. Here's a winding shot from Pierre Reedy. Why not at this point? Maybe you get a slippage in net. You get a nice skip. This ball into the box. Maris trying to chip, and it just goes to the top of the cage. He's playing the central role. Curled into the 18. Williams. Winder finds himself in space. Continues his run. Here's Maris. Glides it wide once more. Can't watch the match. Turn on Sirius XM FC 157, North America's only 24 7 source for engaging soccer talk, including USL All Access Tuesday nights at 7 Eastern. Plus, here live matches. From the USL, Lancaster! Lou City strikes in the 68th minute. They've been building, and now they score. 1-0. It's about the rotation or lack thereof for the two center backs of Charleston Battery. As Palma goes up, there's no rotation, there's no coverage from Leland Archer. And if you give this man, Cameron Lancaster, the time and space to get about 25 yards out to pick up his head. Trey Muse is out of position, calmly just slots it in. All the shots that they were able to produce, three of them in the first 10 minutes of the second half. They haven't attempted one since. That ball brought down cleanly. Traeger working. Shot comes in. Semla, a strong save is Barajas. Excuse me, just misreads the flight of this ball, but want to take nothing away from that first touch from Traeger. I think he closes down the angle when he comes horizontally, and that gives Fidel Barajas the ability just to come around the corner. That's any sword in the corner, making those outside backs extremely vulnerable, beating them with pace. Barajas loops it in and is headed down. Semla has to get the hand to it as it pings over the top of the bar.
Here's a giveaway. After the advantage played for Loose City. Battery back, charging forward. Crawford. Augie Williams chests it down. Augie Williams through. A second chance is blocked away by Kyle Adams. Some seat squirming moments for Loose City fans now. Charleston has found that confidence. Into the box, it goes! We're equal! Emilio Icaza! Charleston brings it back level at one all. Players, and you pull out one of the three center backs. Gaps open up between lines and take nothing away from Fidel Barajas. Knows exactly what he wants to do, picks up his head into a dangerous area. And what a quality finish this is from Ikaza. Heels off the shoulder of Sean Tosh. Makes no mistake about the finish. Andrew Booth is coming in. And Ikaza, the goal scorer, is out. Another corner swinging in. Flicked on, back post! It was empty there. In Martinez area, good things will happen. Ball pinballs around with Markanik at the far end. Harder to miss. Well, this ball does not end up in the back, and that is beyond me. Yeah, any sort of contact. Charleston looked like they had stolen it. Leland Archer will have his words to stay with Brandon Stevis. But the final whistle blows.